North Korea fired what appeared to be two short-range ballistic missiles into the sea off its east coast on Saturday, the South Korean military said. It's the seventh such launch since U.S. President Donald Trump and North Korean leader Kim Jong-un met at the inter-Korean border in June and further complicates attempts to restart talks between the two countries over the future of Pyongyang's nuclear weapons and ballistic missile programs. Trump, though, put a positive spin on things as he headed to the G7 summit in Biarritz on Friday night. I think that we have a very good relationship. We'll see what happens. That could always change, but we'll see what happens. Kim Jong-un has been, you know, pretty straight with me, I think. And we're going to see what's going on. We're going to see what's happening. He, he likes testing missiles, but we never restricted short-range missiles. We'll see what happens. Many nations test those missiles. We tested a very big one the other day, as you probably noticed. The two leaders agreed in June to restart negotiations after an unsuccessful summit back in February. But the United States has so far failed to get the talks going again. Trump says Kim told him earlier this month that he would stop missile testing as soon as the U.S.-South Korea military exercises ended. Those joint military drills are now over. On Friday, North Korea's top diplomat called U.S. Secretary of State Mike Pompeo a die-hard toxin, saying we are ready for both dialogue and standoff. And on Saturday, the North kept up its harsh criticism of sanctions imposed because of its nuclear and missile programs. State media said the U.S. should clearly understand that North Korea will never barter the strategic security of the country for sanctions relief.